friends. I hope you're having an inspiring day. So today we are doing an Everlane fall haul. All cozy up. It has been a hot minute since we've done an Everlane haul, but you will know that Everlane is legit. My go-to day-to-day wear basics. I have been really enjoying my closet, really enjoying the pieces that I have currently from Everlane. So it's been a little while, but they've got some new, new stuff that your girl is excited about and it's all fall and it's all cozy. As always, I will leave all the links to all the products I'm talking about in the description box below. A very big thank you to my friends at Everlane as always for partnering with me on this video. It is such an honor to work with them because I love their, their brand and their products so much. So super excited to share with you some of my new faves. But without further ado, let's get into this Everlane fall cozy haul. All right, let's start with basics because I feel like that's really where Everlane shines. I stand by my statement that they make the best basics on the market. And this first one here is actually one that I've already tried and tested. I got it in the summertime. It is the ripped cutaway tank. It fits so beautifully. The fabric is a really thick ribbed fabric. And more importantly, it holds its shape even after washing and things like that because of the structure of the material. And so naturally, I picked up another one in white, but I also got it in black. I wear these on such heavy repeat, hence the double of the white. And the cutaway ripped tanks are $30. Can you tell why this tank is legit my favorite thing and my favorite tank of all time? A few different components here that I really like. Again, like I said, I have this tank already, so I knew how it was going to fit. But this cutaway here is just so strategic, but just really elevates this tank top. I feel like it makes it look a lot different, almost stylized in its basicness. Uh, the other thing that is really key to note about this tank top is because the fabric is so nice and thick, your girl is not wearing a bra with this. I typically almost always have to wear a bra, but there is no shadow of anything anywhere. It's just, it's the best. And here is that same tank top in black. Again, so simple, but I feel like so chic. Next up is the OG, the cult favorite, organic cotton crew neck. I actually don't have it in a gray, so I picked it up in the gray, um, but then I also got another black one, and then I also got another white one. Um, again, these are just basics that I keep in my closet, as you can see, clearly wear very often. And a few standout things about their tees. Uh, I find that they really hold their shape, again, really well. They don't lose that shape over time, and they are so, so comfortable. And the t-shirts are $24. So here is the organic cotton crew neck. It is just the perfect all around t-shirt. As you can see, it fits perfectly. I wear a size small, mostly in every lane, and the t-shirt's also in small. The full length of the t-shirt I'll show you is a pretty classic length, but it's really handy just to be able to tuck in or wear out depending on however you like to style your tees. It fits nice and comfortably, not too oversized, not too tight either. So it's just really the perfect tee. If there is such a thing, it is this one. And here is the t-shirt in the gray, exact same, just in gray. And here is the t-shirt in black. Again, an all black outfit, but when your clothing fits well, even though it's really classic and basic, it just looks so chic, I feel like. By now, you know my love for Oxford shirts. I have a couple that I've collected from Everlane in the past, but they actually came out with a little bit of a different silhouette. As you can see here, a little bit of a boxy fit, um, as well as this really cute little balloon sleeve. It just makes for a little bit more of a preppy, a little bit more feminine look. I thought this was going to be so cute, kind of layered underneath tanks and things like that. Kind of get to give that schoolgirl sort of vibe. And I'm really excited about how this one's gonna add a little bit of a difference to my closet. Still a classic, still a staple. Not something that you would ever kind of throw away from your closet, but just with a little added feminine touch with the ruched sleeve. And the prep shirt here is $75. 
How cute is this balloon sleeve Oxford? I love the sleeve detail. I feel like it really makes it pop. Now, a couple of things about this shirt here is that it's got a smaller lapel collar here. Uh, it does open up really nicely, which I like. The way I would style it is exactly like this. Maybe not with a black bottom, and if so, maybe with some chunkier jewelry, but if not with a fun bottom or something a little bit more statement. I like it tucked in, but just to show you guys, the length of it kind of tucked out. It's a very classic style fit. I almost wear everything tucked in, but just so you see, that's how it is tucked out. Not super fitted, I would say even a little bit boxier, but the sleeves are just so cute. Okay, let's move into sweaters. If you have seen my previous fall, winter Everlane hauls, you'll know I am obsessed with their sweaters, specifically their cashmere. I have so much Everlane cashmere, and you know your girl stocked up on some new fall staples. So I got two new cashmere crew neck. So this is one of their, again, staple classic pieces. I got it in a little bit of a fun color this season. This is like a sea foamy type of gray green. Again, a neutral color, really easy to match, uh, but just, a little bit of fun as a little bit of interest to the outfit. I feel like it will go really well with white, well, pretty much anything, but I imagine it with like a crisp white pair of bottoms. Some components that I really like about the cashmere crew neck, first one is that it's got this nice thick ribbing at the top where the crew neck is. I just feel like it's an elevated touch. And same with the bottom here. The other thing that I really like is that it's not ruched, it falls flat. So it's not going to create that balloon effect that a lot of cashmere sweaters I find do. As you can see here, it kind of falls straight rather than ruching back in, if you know what I mean. I also got the cashmere crew neck in this gorgeous deep maroon purple color. Again, such a beautiful fall warm color. I feel like this pairs really nicely with brown the exact same silhouette uh, and again made with that super soft Everlane cashmere that we know and love. The cashmere crewnecks here are $120. Here is the cashmere crewneck on. So comfy. I knew it was going to be because like I said, I know and love Everlane's cashmere already. But again, some of the things I love is this nice thick neckline here. How nicely it fits. It's not super tight, but it still gives you a little bit of shape. I would wear it tucked in fully, uh, kind of like a shirt, but just warmer. And I'm loving this gorgeous seafoam green. And here is that gorgeous maroon color, a little bit different, a little bit festive, I feel like, but still a really nice neutral that I feel like will pair really nice with browns. And next up in the sort of light sweater category is this really fun color that honestly is a little bit out of my comfort zone, but I figured I would do one color that's a little bit more fun. And it's this beautiful pinky mauvey purple sweater. This is again in their cashmere, but it's got a nice turtleneck sort of feature here. I would say almost like a mock neck turtleneck. Um, I love that they make their turtlenecks wide enough for your neck where you don't feel like you're being suffocated by them. Another thing about this sweater is, as you can see, it does not ruch in at the bottom. So again, you're not getting that bubble type effect. And the cashmere square turtleneck here is $195. Okay, here is the mauve sweater on. I wasn't sure how I was gonna feel about this color, but I'm actually liking it quite a bit now. It's really nice because again, it's got this really nice straight line action instead of bulbousing in or tightening in, <laughs> rather creating a bulbous shape. I really like that it flows like this. It allows you to layer on top of something like a slip skirt really nicely. This higher neckline is a really nice touch. I feel like turtlenecks are my vibe for the fall, winter season. And again, the cashmere, so cozy and comfortable. And mauve is growing on me, guys. Mauve is growing on me. So cashmere is obviously an investment. It's one of those things that I feel like you invest in, put in your closet, and then never really take out. In my opinion, if you don't have any cashmere in your closet, I would recommend going for those neutral colors like the beiges, the blacks, which Everlane all has. I got some fun colors because I have a lot of black and beiges. Uh, in cashmere from Everlane already, but I would definitely recommend going that neutral route so that you can kind of wear it with everything. I know, again, it's a bit of an investment, but for pieces that will never kind of leave your closet uh, and kind of go with everything, I feel like it's definitely worth it. Let's move on to chunky, thicker sweaters because tis the season. As you can see, I am a creature of habit, and especially when it comes to Everlane pieces, 
I feel like a little bit of an expert because I have shopped and loved their pieces so much that I really know the styles that I'm gonna like and really like to wear over and over again. This one in particular is another one of those that I got two of. So the first one is in this beigey cream color. I love this color from Everlane. I just feel like it goes so well with cool neutrals as well as warm neutrals, but this is their double-breasted knitted cardigan, and it's got a few key components that I really like. The first one is that it's got little pockets on the side. I feel like it makes it a little bit cozier, but the star winner component of this cardigan here is the fact that it is double-breasted, which I think makes it so unique almost makes it look like a blazer. Uh, it is so comfortable, this fabric, again, this knit that, that they do. It is such a nice blend. Again, passes the itch test. I already knew this because I've, again, loved, have, buy Everlane products quite a bit. So I got it in this cream color and I also got it in a classic black because you know your girl is having a moment again with her black monochrome pieces. I just feel like they're the pieces I just never give away the, the pieces that I always have in my closet. The cut on these is a little bit boxier. These are my true to size size, which is a size small in Everlane. So keep in mind that it is a little bit of a boxier cut. And these ones here are $845. Here is the double-breasted cardigan. So cute. Again, super, super cozy. I love this double-breasted action. I feel like it really makes it stand out as a cardigan. I haven't really seen very many like this. And the color just so, so easy to match. Really easy to kind of just throw on and go. And here is the black on black version. So cute. Again, really cozy, really easy outfits, which is one of my favorite things about Everlane. I also just noticed this really cute little E embroidery that they have. I really like that Everlane doesn't do really heavy branding on their clothing, it just makes it a little bit more timeless, but love that little touch there, so cute. Last up in the chunky sweater category is this beautiful, rich, caramel half zip sweater. It's got that nice, thick, chunky turtleneck aspect, which of course then you can zip open and kind of let fall to the sides um, and just open up your neckline a little bit more. Again, a straight line sweater. I absolutely adore that Everlane does this. They don't cinch the bottom. It just makes layering so much easier. If you live in a cold climate, you know exactly what I'm talking about. It just lets things flow instead of like ruching things up. But again, fabric that is so soft and comfortable. I really don't know how they do it. It's so nice and thick, but not itchy, which for sweaters is my number one because you will never wear a sweater that is not comfortable for you. Again, just such a beautiful neutral color that will pair well with everything. And this sweater here is $145. Here is the half zip on. I love how cozy, but still somehow put together. It looks so, so comfortable. And I love that it has this really nice and deep zip. I feel like it gives it a little bit more oomph because you really see this collar kind of pop up. The other thing is that it kind of tucks so nicely on its own. It folds so beautifully and again just such a nice color. All right let's move on to pants. You guys know that I live and die by Everlane's straight leg pants. They are my favorite pants period, full stop. I have them in every single color. When I say every single color, I mean every single color. Um, pretty much all the neutrals and even some seasonal colors that they've come out with, they just fit so well. They can be dressed up, dressed down. Really, I don't need to share how much I love them because truly I've made videos entirely dedicated to the Everlane straight leg pant, but we did go and have a little bit of fun. I feel like this is traditionally what you would think to be a spring color, but your girl's having a moment with greens and I just fell in love with this one here. I feel like it goes so well, again, with neutrals, a lot of warm neutrals, so I felt like it was gonna brighten up my fall looks. So this is actually the way hygiene. This is not a straight leg pant, but I do find that their denim fits very similar to their straight leg pant style. Um, I will leave the straight leg pant in the description box below as well, because as you can tell, they are my favorites, but I also have Everlane denim and I love them. They do high-waisted denim really, really well. Um, I have quite a few of their blue ones, but again, nothing in a fun color. I felt like this was going to be such a unique piece, a little bit more of a standout 
uh, piece in an outfit rather than a neutral. A few components that I really like is the seam that runs down the, the leg of the pant. I'll show you guys when I put it on, but it does give your legs a little bit more of an elongated look. The fabric on all their denim is really comfortable. This one has a little bit of stretch to it, but it just hugs so, so nicely. And again, this is the way high jean. So again, it is super high waisted, which I just prefer. It is just definitely my comfort style of a pant or bottom, but they have so many different varieties of denim on their site. I would definitely recommend checking them out. I have the 90s, I have the 90s chibi jean, I have the Arc Utility Barrel Pant. I just have a ton of Everlane bottoms. They are by far my favorite and probably 80% of my pant wardrobe collection. And the Way High Jeans, which like I said, comes in all the classic colors as well, is $88. So here are the Way High jeans on. So, so cute. I love the way they fit. I love that it's got that seam running down the pant as well. I feel like it is just so flattering. Other than that, fits definitely high-waisted. Very, very comfortable. Honestly, I'm not surprised because I love pretty much every Everlane pair of pants, but a reminder that these actually also come in more neutral colors if you're looking for that, but I kind of like this green. I feel like it's very fun and bright for the fall winter season. Last but not least, let's talk about shoes. I've also done a dedicated video on Everlane footwear because again, I love them so much. They're made in Italy. They are so comfortable, mold to your feet, and are truly just those classic footwear pieces that you will have forever. As you can see, I am a huge fan of the Day Glove Flat. This is one of their footwear claim to fame, I feel like, and for really good reason. And the color that I hummed and awed over for a while but didn't actually have is a white one. Now, I know what you're thinking, Mel, white for the fall winter season, but we are past the whole no wearing white after Labor Day rule and we are trying to build a closet that is year round and so I got the pair in white. Again, I do have it in black and a lot of the other, I have a caramel as well. So I do have some of the other colors that I probably would have got before this white pair. But if you're looking for the best ballerina flat, this is it. Uh, so I did eventually get the white pair. They are just so comfortable. They mold to your feet. I'll take my black one off here so you can kind of see like the indentations that the leather kind of how it molds to your feet and then becomes literally the most comfortable flat you will ever wear. It's got a nice cushioned sole to it too, a nice cushioned rubber sole, so you're not walking on like flat, slippery surface on the bottom. It also has these little air vents in the leather here, no inner lining, so the leather really has that opportunity to mold to your foot. Super breathable, comfortable, and again, just my favorite flat, period. If you're unfamiliar, the day gloves come in a variety of different colors and they are $115. So I've pretty much been wearing the black versions this entire video, but here are the white ones on. Again, so comfortable, so easy to pair with everything. Such a cute pop, actually. This white is a really nice pop to any outfit, but again, they've got tons of different colors and the winners to them is obviously the fact that they are just so, so comfortable. As you can see, it's already molding to my feet. And last up in the boot category, I have quite a few, as you can tell by the theme of this video, I have quite a few Everlane pieces, but Everlane does their Chelsea boots really well. Now I am a size 10 and typically when I get boots, they don't fit well because the ankles of them are just too wide for my feet. And now what Everlane does really well is elasticized Chelsea boots. So I got this one here. Again, it comes in a couple of different colors. It comes in an all black as well, but I was kind of missing fun boot colors. I have quite a few. I think I have like three Chelsea black boots, uh, ironically all from Everlane. And so I thought I would throw in a fun color to the mix here. I love their creams. I find that their creams and their whites go with my neutrals really, really well. This is a little bit of a different style of Chelsea boot. It has a couple of different elements to it that I found really interesting. I really like this rubberized sole as well as this brown stitching on the bottom here. I believe it's the same for the black color as well, uh, but the black and black versus the white and black, obviously. And this one here, again, just like the day glove is going to mold to your feet 
Um, again, like I said, I have it a Chelsea boot in black. Um, I have their Western boot in black as well. And all of these I have worn season after season, even in snow and slush and they are still my go-tos. So I got this pair here just to have a little bit of fun, a little bit of pop of brightness, and their Chelsea boot with gun sole is $195. Here are the white Chelsea boots on. I just wanted to show you how well they fit your ankle. They don't flare out at the ankle, which is what I love about it. It actually fits my ankle properly, and if you have a wider angle, because it's got that stretchy element on the side here, it actually holds and makes whatever shape your ankle is, it kind of form fits to it so you don't have that gaping wide ankle look for your boot. It actually makes everything look really nice and seamless. I just pulled up the pant leg so you guys can see but even with a pant it just fits so seamlessly because it's nice and tight. Looks so great and I love this pop of white. I just feel like this adds a lot of fun dynamic to your outfit for the fall winter season but again they do also have this in a black. And that is it for my Everlane haul today. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I could honestly create videos all day about Everlane pieces because I love them so much. I feel like I can make a million different outfits with just one piece. And I think that that's really where I want my closet to be. A lot of fun mixing and matching, a lot of classic silhouettes that aren't really going to go out of style. And that is Everlane. If you haven't seen me rant about Everlane enough in this video and many of my previous videos, voila, here you are, me ranting. But I hope you guys like that. Let me know in the comments below your favorites as well, as well as if you like Everlane, I would love to know. And if you have any favorites from theirs, because I have quite a few. I love their Pima ribbed cotton. I love their straight leg pants, obviously. Their tees, I love as well. So I would love to know. I love to kind of fangirl together about our favorites. But thank you as always so much for hanging out with me. If you are new to the Inspire family, we'd love it if you would join us and subscribe. But with that, friends, I hope you have an inspiring rest of your day. Remember that kindness doesn't cost a thing, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.